Hey guys, uh, welcome back to my channel. Those who are new to my channel, I'm Reshma. I got AI202 in Gate 2022 in EC and currently I'm doing MTech in MVLSI from IIT Kharagpur. So after uh, Gate 2023, I have been receiving a lot of messages and queries. Uh, so it is not possible for me to reply to everyone. So few of the questions which were repetitive, I uh, shortlisted some of them and uh, I'm going to discuss them in this video. So yes, uh, first question, my rank is not good enough to get into IIT. So should I take admission in NIT or XYZ college and prepare along with the DAT or take drop? So see, there are um, many constraints. Like if you have financial constraint and you have to uh, do MTech, you have to take admission this year only and uh, family is not supporting you. So in that case, uh, you have to join college, but see if you get VLS in NITs also, then also you are safe and you'll get good placements. But uh, when you are joining MTech, then after that, uh, try avoid preparing along with that because in that scenario, you will neither be doing your MTech properly and nor uh, uh, you could succeed in gate like there are uh, exceptions who do that, but I won't suggest that. So uh, either you take full drop or if you are uh, joining MTech, then do that MTech seriously and uh, bag a good job from there. So, uh, and uh, next uh, question is, uh, should I prepare along with job or not like, uh, or leave job? So um, in that scenario, if you consider my case, I left my job and then prepare. For that, you can check my first video, uh, uh, which I'll put in the description box below. And uh, then here also uh, is that I, I know few people who have prepared along with job and have succeeded in gate. So yes, if you could manage your time well, you can do that along with job also. I have few of my batchmates also who have prepared along with job. So you can do that. But uh, if you think that uh, uh, you want to give 100% to a gate preparation and you don't have that kind of financial restrictions, then you can leave your job and give 100% to the preparation also. So uh, yes, now uh, next is I'm in final year. Should I go for placement or uh, should I prepare for gate and uh, or should I do both? See, uh, you know which kind of companies visit your college. So uh, if uh, your dream companies are visiting your college, like you are satisfied with those placements, then you can go for placements. But otherwise, don't uh, see your friends that, okay, they are getting placed and I am not uh, placed till now and I am preparing for GATE on and all that. If your goal is GATE, like PSUs or IITs, these are your goals, then uh, I would say that uh, don't waste your time in placement preparations. And if not so good companies come, comes to your college, like you are in dietary college and not so good companies, Companies comes and if uh, you are in like uh, CSE or IT and uh, you want to get into good job and uh, you are doing coding and there are lots of opportunities like from tier three colleges also people are getting good placements. So if that is your ultimate goal and MTech and IITs are not into your list, then you can uh, you should go for placements. But otherwise, uh, for electronics like uh, if you if not core, if core companies are not visiting your college and uh, you want to get placed in some of the core companies and you have to do MTech or uh, MTech from Tier 1 college, then uh, you should prepare only for gate and uh, not get swayed away by uh, preparing for placements or wasting your time in that. Okay. So uh, next question uh, I'm receiving is about cutoffs. So. Uh, Yes, you can visit the respective websites of IITs and uh, NITs also for uh, previous year cutoffs. I <laughs> I really cannot have the whole database. So, yes, I can say about mine uh, offers which I got. Uh, I I got uh, rank two zero two in EC uh, and uh, in general category. So I got uh, M Tech in M VLSI in IIT Kharagpur in additional round B. That is like um, after five regular rounds, I got it in the additional round two. So seventh round, you can say. So now uh, I've been receiving questions that gate, gate gone bad. And so what's next? And uh, I'm depressed and all. So uh, see, uh, 
don't get depressed it's just an exam and uh, i also gave uh, bad in my 2021 gate and i did not score well but uh, i started my preparation uh, soon after uh, gate uh, like uh, i took few weeks of break and uh, from mid march i started my preparation again for the next year so uh, if you keep on uh, repenting on that then uh, you will be missing time so uh, start from now only if you have not yet started and you were targeting 2023 2024 gate sorry then uh, start from now only and don't repent over that it's just an exam and uh, there are many opportunities after that also okay so don't waste your time in that now uh, next question i have been receiving that tips and then uh, see there is there are no shortcut to a uh, gate that uh, there is some shortcut i would say and you would uh, uh, qualify it so uh, there is no shortcut and yes what it takes to crack gate i have been receiving this also so it's consistency determination and hard work if uh, you are consistent you are disciplined every day and uh, you have that self motivated uh, that you have to crack it then just this is needed and hard work will ultimately come if you are self motivated and you have that goal fixed so this is only needed and okay uh, so do comment uh, that uh, what uh, you would like the next video on what topic and uh, please subscribe to my channel for more videos like this and uh, yeah all the best start your preparation if you are targeting for 2024 all the best